Ren Rising, Cosmic Gods and Goddesses, thanks for tapping in. Thanks for stopping by. We're going to shift energy here. Um, I'm going to do a quick uh, general energy check in for the collective. See what messages the Divine Spirit, Spirit Guides, the Angels, and the Ancestors have at this time for the collective. So, what do we have here, Holy Spirit? Please and thank you. Thank you guys are amazing. I'm sending lots of love and high vibrations your way. Messages for the collective. Messages for the collective Holy Spirit. Out of love, light, and truth. Only please and thank you. What's the energy here? Messages for the collective. We have trust. And we have loneliness. We have loneliness in reverse. What else? Anything else? And we have forgiveness in reverse. Wow. So the energy I'm getting here, collective, is that there is somebody who once trusted somebody. They wanted to forgive them because they didn't want to be by themselves. They trusted them and now they regret that they trusted this person. Okay. In a relationship, they don't want to be in this relationship anymore or they're no longer in this relationship because somebody has broken the trust. They did. This person left this person. They didn't want to be lonely. They couldn't forgive them for what they did, you know. Wow, somebody's in regret because they broke the trust and now the relationship is over. So let's see what this is, collective. That's the energy. So what's going on in this relationship? Holy Spirit, please and thank you. What do they need to know? What do they need to be aware of? At this time, Holy Spirit, out of love, light, and truth. Somebody can't forgive somebody for what they did. Even though they didn't want to call this relationship off, it's like they feel like they had no other choice because there was no trust there, you know. Wow. Somebody's in regret. They regret the way things turned out or they regret for fucking up. <laughs> yeah. Whatever it is, the shit's complicated. Okay, this is a complicated situation here. What's here, Holy Spirit? What do I need to be aware of? What do I need to know? Yeah, somebody's person had roaming eyes here. Yeah, somebody's person had roaming eyes here. They was uh, being disrespectful or they was openly being, obviously, obviously openly being a flirt, you know. And that broke the trust in the relationship. Okay. Wow. And then we have two faced here. Okay. Somebody wasn't wasn't being sincere about how they truly felt. And this is why somebody's like, Well, yeah, well, if you don't really feel that way about me, then you know, your emotions, you're you're insincere, like this is not what somebody thought thought it was supposed to be. I mean, you know, they found out their person was two-faced and that they were still, you know, obviously flirting with other people, being disrespectful, you know, keeping their possibilities open. Okay. And, well, what else? Yeah, they figured out this person was nothing but a silver tongue devil, you know, just talking shit, you know, gaslighting, just a big flirt. This was a whole big old flirt out here. And they was obviously flirting with people, you know, could have been flirting with other people in front of you. Okay? I feel like this person was just playing with your emotions. You can't trust this person anymore. You're, you're realizing this person was all talk. That they didn't mean shit they said. You know, to you this person was being um, disrespectful. Okay? Like a player. You know? Just a player. And you're not forgiving them for coming into your life, playing with your emotions. 
are either disrespecting you, be it feminine or masculine. That's what I'm saying. You're not forgiving this person, even though you would want to. Because they're going to come to you because they're such a big liar and fucking tell you that, hey, I didn't mean to hurt you. You know what I'm saying? And expect you to forgive them. But whatever the fuck they did this time, you're not forgiving this two-faced motherfucker, this two-faced bitch. You're not. Because you know that they're obviously a flirt and they're disrespectful and they're openly flirting with other people right in front of you. This is nothing but a fucking player and you picked up on it. Okay. Wow. They have skeletons in their closet. Mm -hmm. Yes, they do. They got things that they, about them that they weren't telling you, especially being a player. You know what I'm saying? That they were still playing the fucking field out here looking for other lovers. You know? That apparently you wasn't enough to, for, for this player. They was doing too fucking much. They was out here just going through the motions. You regret you ever hooked up with this motherfucker or oh, this bitch. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. You got rid of them. You thought of a way, or you thinking of a way to get rid of them. This is a past, present, or future energy here. Okay, yeah. Get prepared for sudden changes because you're about to find out something about this relationship. Because the more to it, okay, that's going to make you unhappy to hear the rest of what the fuck this player was up to. For one, we already know they had you in competition. It's the bottom of the deck. We already know they had you in competition. What else is here? That's the collective needs to be aware of. This person couldn't keep their eyes off other people. I'm getting the energy that she was done with some sort of nephomaniac or something. Okay. Mm. This is a lot, but I want to take a look at them. Mmm. Yeah, this person's definitely a player. They were definitely a player. Okay. Wow. They were definitely a player. What else is here, Spirit? A player, a two-faced player is what you were dealing with. It was all talk, they didn't mean shit they said. And they want, they want you to believe that they're sorry for what they did, but they're not sorry. They don't have any regret at all. They just going through the motions, okay? Wow. I'm saying what they feel they need to say to get back in your energy. Mm -hmm. But you want out of this relationship if you're still in it. And some of y'all about to make a move to get out of this relationship with this fucking player here. Some of y'all done already did it. Found out they were nothing but a big ass fake. A fraud. You know what I'm saying? Tell me what you want to hear. Gaslight, love bomb, and piece of shit ass motherfucker. Okay. Wow. I'm getting an undercover hater. Damn, this motherfucker was an undercover hater, a hater too. Are you either question, you know, if this motherfucker really hated you, the reason why they did you like this, or, you know, is they just a fucking all out hater, period? Oh, man. I was they just hating on you. Hmm. I'm going to give you at the pause and think about that shit. This is for all zodiac signs. Yeah, whoever this motherfucker was wanted you to be a side piece. They was just all top of their two-faced ass. Okay. You could be a, a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio here. You could be any sign though. Tell us more. They wanted you to be a side piece. That's why you wonder if this player, you know, this fake ass motherfucker, was just hating on you or was they just a hater, period. Thought you was going to be a side piece to they funky ass, to they two faced ass, while they was obviously being a flirt and being disrespectful. Wow. You wanted to forgive them, but you're not going to, you, you, they just all talk and you know it. You know it. Some of y'all regret I ever met this motherfucking player. Just tell me what you want to hear. Love bombing. Yeah. Gaslighting you and shit like that. If somebody here was paid to hurt somebody's motherfucking feelings, ain't that a bitch? 
Who pays somebody to hurt somebody's feelings? Yeah, they doing too much here. This one nothing but a piece of trash. Okay, it could have been a piece of trash. You paid this person to come in and, and hurt your feelings. Okay, but you're going to get some justice out of the situation here. Uh, from this false ass motherfucker that was putting on the front to get up in your energy any motherfucking way. Okay, yeah, they had hidden motives. Uh huh. Somebody put them up to this shit. Somebody put them up to this shit to hurt your feelings or to call yourself, you know, playing you or whatever. It was another party involved in this shit. What's going on here, spirit? Like I said, there's more to it than this motherfucker just being a player is gonna make you unhappy or feel uncomfortable when you fucking find out what the fuck really happened. So what's going on here, spirit? Tell us more. What's collective need to know? Well, they need to be aware. Please and thank you. This creepy motherfucker. Well, for one, you need to know that you're divinely protected. Okay. From trash, you know. People that that's doing too motherfucking much. Okay. People that you need to let go of. Okay, that you have let, let them go. All right. Because they're doing too motherfucking much here. Okay. Some of them spreading rumors and shit. Because for some of y'all, somebody that you know, pay somebody to to play on you. Or play on your emotions and shit. Play this two-faced motherfucker. That's why they two-faced. Because they were talking to you and working for somebody else. Okay, all up in your motherfucking face. Alright. But they got paid to do it too. Okay, is what I'm getting here. They got paid to betray you by somebody. All right. I don't know who this motherfucker somebody is. But they didn't realize you was divinely protected by the most high. Okay. Yeah, this person is guilty. Whoever this is that paid somebody to, uh, they in regret. Because that's double confirmation on the regret here. You're getting away from them. I don't know who is hating on you or there is a hater in the midst or something amongst this player, a fake ass motherfucker who put this person up to, to you know, trying to play you, to betray you. Wow. Somebody was people pleasing here, putting on the front because they got paid to do it. Wow, ain't that some shit? I wonder who did that. That's the most... <laughs> One of your fake ass friends, okay. It wasn't one of your fake ass friends. Spirit said it was a third party, okay. A third party who wanted to see you get played, uh, a secret lover, all right. Mm. They wanted to see you get played. Wow, this could have been, you know, just a third party, could have just been just a third party, just somebody else, not somebody that they was intimate with, but just somebody who was. Oh, wow. Jealous and envious of you. Okay. I wanted to see you get betrayed. They paid this person to hurt your feelings because they a hater. They hate you. They, hate, they don't like you. Whoever the fuck this is. This bitch or this motherfucker. Yeah, they had somebody watching you the whole time. This fake-ass friend. That's what I'm getting. This is your fake-ass friend. What else is here? I'm going to take what resonates to the rest for someone else. If it does not apply, simply let this shit fly, okay? What else, fear? What else do you want them to know? Please and thank you. Please and thank you. We got fire signs out here. Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. I don't know. Somebody may have stolen something from you. Wow. Well, in the past, you may have called the police. Okay, this person's envied you ever since and been in competition with you for some fucking reason. They wanted to compete with you. And for some of you, this is it's a karmic feminine. Okay. A karmic feminine or a fake-ass friend. All right. They may want your forgiveness now, but you're not willing to give it to them. Okay. <laughs> some of y'all, y'all tired of the games and shit. Okay, y'all try to take pattern of behavior. This hater, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. 
like I said, somebody could have got some money stolen in the past for some of you. That's for somebody here. I'm picking this energy up. And the money got recovered. Okay, but somebody was still holding a grudge. Okay. And still full of jealousy here. All right. They could have stolen your money. All right. And still this shit behind your back because they was mad. Maybe, you know, they thought you accused them and maybe rightfully so. I don't know. But there's a lot of enviousness, you know what I'm saying? Somebody's trying to seek some attention by, you know, hurting you, paying somebody to, you know, act like they want to be with you. You know what I'm saying? Or either this was a third party that was in competition with you and paid somebody to do some dumb shit. You know, you may have been single, you know, and this person may have been wanting to date you. They may have put this person up to it, paid them to act like they wanted you just so they could fuck with your head. You know what I'm saying? Out of jealousy, though. Out of jealousy. I don't know. Let's see what else. The spirit wants to reveal here. What's on the bottom? Shit. Spirit said this is a lot more serious than you think. Whoever this is that's doing this shit behind the scenes is very sneaky. Okay. This karmic feminine or this fake friend here. What else is here? They even could have got their person to pretend like they wanted to be with you when you found out that it was their person. Or it's one of their exes they used to date. You know, they paid them to try to play you. The fuck? Just to cause some drama. They're very sneaky. This is a very sneaky, sneaky karmic. Okay. Well, wow, this could also be work related. This could be somebody you work with here. Okay. What else is here, Spirit? What else is collective need to know? Be aware of at this time. What else is here, Spirit? Please and thank you. Steady watching you. Okay. There's lots of jealous energy here. I'm telling you, whoever this fake friend of this karmic feminine is, they're real jealous of you. Okay. Is what I'm getting here. Yeah. They're cheating with your family member. Okay. Cheating with your family member. So this is the player that tried to play you. Is cheating with your family member. And they was paid to do that shit too. Yeah. They want you to think that you're crazy. That you make shit up. You got some type of mental problem. Something like that. But yeah. You know what you saw. Or you know what I'm saying. In the parking lot or the garage. Or something you saw in the parking lot. Or in the garage. Or just fucking in your fucking community. Okay. Wow. Lots of jealous energy I'm picking up here. Or it's people in your community that's being very sneaky and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like somebody in your community shit cheated with your person. Or put this player up to <clears throat> put this player up to cheating on you. Okay. Or this could have been somebody stinking ass baby mama. Yeah. That's very jealous of you, very sneaky. But you're divinely protected. Okay. They sent somebody in, an imposter, you know, to play you. Because they still jealous and envious, you know. Spirit said, game over. All right. Yeah, now they want to come in and apologize and say they weren't in their right mind. But they want to make you think you was crazy. Yeah, but this karmic got with your person to antagonize you and they was paid to do so. Okay. But see, they didn't know that you was protected. Now these motherfuckers sitting back speechless. They don't know what the fuck to say. You know what I'm saying? They don't know what the fuck to say because they didn't know you was protected. Alright. These motherfuckers is all in bad health now and shit. You know. They want to apologize, but you ain't thinking about them. You the one on your way. You know what I'm saying? You ain't forgot. What they tried to do to you. Okay. See the truth hurts some motherfuckers. They can't stand it. And they know what they was doing. And the shit came out. Yeah. 
couple of psychopaths, unpredictable motherfuckers that was trying to play in your energy. Okay. Whoever this player was was also cheating with your cousin's friend. Wow. And one of your family members too. And they cousin's friend. Wow. But they was put up to do this shit to you. For some of y'all, by y'all fake family members. For some of y'all, it was a fake ass friend or a fucking co-worker. Our family member. Oh shit, one of your, your mother or your aunt could have been involved in this shit. Now these motherfuckers are speechless, okay? Wow. They could could have hooked you up um, under some false pretenses of somebody in, in your uh, community here. Yeah. Put you on competition. But they know they was already, whoever this player was, was already cheating with your cousin. Now your person could be cheating with your cousin, okay? Or your cousin's friend. Or one of your fucking family members, okay? And your mother or your motherfucking aunt could have been involved in this whole shit. And now they fucking speechless because they didn't know that you was protected. Mm hmm But somebody might somebody discovered that you was protected. Divinely protected at that. Here. Wow. Hating on you because you found out the truth. Are you gonna be finding out the truth that these motherfuckers is very sneaky and they was pulling a dirty ass trick? Okay, but that shit backfired on the ass. And I see someone crying in that bad health for the way they tried to do you. Okay. Huh. I don't know. Someone might be genuinely remorseful. That's what Spirit said for putting you in competition in the first place. Because like I said, they just not really, some of them just not discovering that you are protected. Not just protected, but you're divinely protected. They in bad health. Like I said, this even could have been uh, work-related for some of you. You know what I'm saying? They want to apologize to you for everything. Because somebody here may be genuinely remorseful. Okay. Wow. And it could have been this player. Okay, or the delusional third party that thought this shit up to put you in competition in the first place. Yeah, the one you suspect. This is how Spirit put it. The one you suspect. Yeah, that's the one. Yeah. That friend. Mm-hmm. Cool. Spirit said you know who they are. Fucking psychopath. That toxic motherfucker. That toxic bitch. Okay. Uh uh uh. Wow. One more spirit. These motherfuckers be weak as hell out here playing these weak ass games. Okay. And then want to turn around and ask for forgiveness. You know, after they did the little dumb shit. Like, what the fuck do they be thinking? Because they're going to end up regretting doing the shit anyway. Especially when they find out. You are divinely protected one. Uh-huh. Well, haters gonna hate, but spirit gonna always congratulate. Okay? When you're divinely protected, all right? Your haters gonna feel remorseful within the next 72 hours. Okay? Whenever you uh, come across this message, your haters are gonna to genuinely be remorseful for what they did to you within the next 72 hours. I don't care how many motherfuckers was involved. Somebody was paid to have somebody gaslight you. Uh, yeah. Mm. You ain't giving them no more chances to do that shit again. Alright. That message is for someone. But in the next 72 hours, this trust and belief spirits that they will be suffering. Okay, they will be suffering. But you are protected. Not just protected, you're the family protected. Okay. Wow. Whoever these people are, they don't have the class that you have. Um, period. Okay. These motherfuckers are going to be terrified within the next 72 hours. And suffering. Okay. And speechless. And speechless. Because the discovery that they're going to make about you, the reason why they're going to be suffering, the reason why they're going to be suffering and speechless, these haters... Because they're going to see that you're protected. Not only protected, but divinely protected. Alright. And they're about, to, they're about to see that. Spirit's going to make them see that. Okay. They're going to make bad health. And I don't know what else is going to happen. 
And it's all because, you know, they was jealous and envious and put somebody up to gaslight you. And Spirit said that was wrong. And, and hey, they're going to find out what's going to happen to them within the next 72 hours. And until next time, peace, love, and light. Namaste for now.